Hi, hello. Now we're going to find out what Fire say about MP3 tag, the universal tag editor and more. Okay, let's fire it up. All right, now MP3 tag editor, universal tag editor, <laughs> um, you can edit the metadata in a wide range of audio, um, audio formats. You got the advanced audio coding, that's the AAC. Um, you got the digital stream, direct stream digital audio, that's DSF. Um, also the FLAC audio, the APE, that's monkeys audio, <laughs> MP3 of course. And hey, the one I like, MPEG-4. Um, got a wide range of formats we can edit in the MPEG-4. Um, that's the MP4, M4A, M4B, M4V and iTunes. All right. Um, also, MPC, the OGG, OPUS, the OFR, um, and WMA. Yes, you can edit the metadata in <laughs> WMA um, audio. Um, and similar to Wave, but not Wave. All right. And that's um, Wave Pack. That's WV extension. Um, you're not able to add metadata in um, Wave files. All right. So let's just go through it. Um, here I have um, a list of um, some MP3 files I have here. Okay, um, you can rename the file. You cannot change the extension. You can rename the file here. Um, or should I say don't try and change the extension. You'll mess up your file. Um, you can change your artist um, information, the title of the song, the album. Um, here you got the path, you can change the path, right? Um, you can add album artists, the sort of tag format is using the track number, the disc number, the year, the genre, um, add certain comments to it, um, the BPMs, and the codec, the bitrate, the frequency the length of the file and the date modified all right and you got some other options you can actually um add here as well um mp3 tag editor also gives you the option where you can bulk edit your files so you can select all the files and you can actually add certain um, information to them or delete certain information all right um you can add like things like the year um the if you want to add the year to all the songs and uh, here i can say i want all my songs to be challenged to be soca okay um and what i like about it as well you can add your album art to it okay you can add remove um extract the cover um set the cover type um oh a wide range of options um, you can rename your files from the tag to the file name or from the file name to the tag with these options here from tag to file name or from file name to tag or file name to file name. Um, that's a wide range. You can, um, a lot of things you can do here with it and it helps you name your file, name your file properly. It helps you name your file properly so that later on when you add it to your library and stuff you can retrieve it very very easy it um it don't automatically gives you the bpm okay i know some dj's would uh, love that but certain files you um extract maybe from cds and stuff you can actually get the information online from this uh, different um online sites here you can actually automatically capture the track title and the artists and stuff from these uh, sites online okay now i wouldn't be teaching you how to use the software but just telling you um, a little about it so out of five stars i will give this four and a half the reason why you it don't give me the bpm you cannot scan and find the bpm of the file and all um that's one feature i wish this thing had and two um sometimes i have very large um album art and i just wish i could just make them smaller sometimes the size of my album art is even bigger than my actual mp3 file itself so i wish there was some way i could just resize my album cover and you know make it a smaller and easier to handle file that's why i'll give it a 
four and a half out of five. So that's it for MP3, the universal tag editor and more.